Hello everybody, this is Anna and welcome to another tutorial of Telenium Marketing. Today we are going to do another tutorial on Golden Ratio logo design and today I will create another logo design. So let's start now. What I'm going to do, I'm using the golden spirals of my last tutorial that I've created. So if you want to know how the golden spirals will form, then you can see my last tutorial. Then you will easily find out the way to design it. And right now I, in this tutorial, I want to use uh, this one so let's start now first of all what I'm going to do I am taking the copy of uh, this circle here and now I want to press it and now just drag it to downside simply like this and now what I'm going to do I'm taking this one and keeping it here simply like this and now I want to take a copy of this here and keeping it here. And now you need to make sure everything is aligned and centrally aligned. Or, and now what I'm going to do, I'm just uh, increasing the size so it will be quite easy for you to look around how things are doing here. So I'm just creating some reference line here. For example, center line here and now I want to place it here simply increase the size height pishy and now move it to the another side keeping in the same place and now what I'm going to do I'm taking a copy of it and rotating it to 90 degree angle and keeping it a middle just here so it will be looking like this now what I'm going to do I want to take this one here and uh, you know I need uh, one more uh, smaller one so a smaller rectangle so what I'm going to do I'm pressing ctrl C ctrl F and now I'm going to transform and divide it to 1.618 so it would be looking like this. Now press Ctrl G to keep it here and place it here. Now Ctrl C, Ctrl F again and move it down. And what I'm going to do, just simply like this. So it needs to be look like this. Yes. And now I'm selecting both together and keeping it in the middle so it would be looking like this when you will do these things now what i'm going to do i'm selecting it together and removing the middle one and now i want to keep it here at the another side just like this when you are doing all these things and you need to make sure make sure that uh, your lines are well connected together otherwise it will not create a simple shape when you were going to use the shape builder tool okay so this is the simple thing that we want to i want to share with you now going to the polygon and here i simply want to create a triangle like this to scale it down simply like this now rotate it transform rotate it to 90 degree angle just like this now place it here and take a copy of it and transform it reflect it vertical and drag it to the another side and now it would be looking like this now so what i'm going to do i'm taking this bank tool now and here i want to change the stroke color to black so what I'm going to do, I'm simply taking this point and this point along with this and here I want to connect it simply these uh, triangles are for the references to connect lines so it would be looking like this. Now what I'm going to do if I will select 
these lines together so I want to see control C control F to place in same place and now I'm going to reflect it with the 90 degree angle and I want to move it here simply make sure everything is well aligned just like this and now what I'm going to do I want to keep it here so everything is well calculated and connected together now I want to do a similar thing here and just design it like this and connect it together simply now take this one shape control c control f reflect it to vertical and now see i am going to connect it here like this so here it would be looking like this now what I'm going to do, I'm selecting each and everything together like this and now I'm using this shape builder tool and here I want to create a simple shape like this and simply like this and Now you can connect these two shapes as well and this one so it would be looking like this now now rest of the lines we will remove it select it together and here same one same way here this one from here and this one from here and here what we have left now again use this shape builder tool and I want to keep it like this. I think I have uh, so let's connect it then we will connect uh, the shapes again. Now what I'm going to do I'm, I want to take this one here and now I want to use this gradients gems and drills and here I want to use this one like this and here I want to use this one here and but with the different color formation so now you can see that this one is quite like this so this one need to be look like this so what I will do I will just connect a simple line here and now I will select each and everything together and here I will do the shape like this so you can see the shape is formed now what I'm going to do I will remove this stroke uh, from here so it would be looking like this now you can take it and you can move it down so you can remove the lines that has been left during the cleaning and now what I'm going to do I'm pressing ctrl C ctrl F here and uh, using it down press ctrl G and now keep it here and arrange and go back and it would be looking like this now and now we are going to select each and everything together like this now press ctrl C ctrl F again transform reflect it here like this it here so it would be looking like this now now take it together ctrl G and again paste in same place and now rotate it transform and rotate it to 90 degree angle so and setting just like this so you can see I will extend it to back then you can see here everything is also in here 
here so just to balance the things and now what i'm going to do i want to take this one make sure everything is clean there should not be any points left and now you can take it here in the middle and uh, here you can go into the object and expand it be like this so this is the you know uh, the logo design that we have just created just by connecting the shape by using golden ratios so this is a very simple and easy way you can easily do it if you want to do it and uh, thank you so much for watching i will come back to another tutorial and subscribe to my channel have a very good day bye, -bye.